Yes, integrated science, grade 7. Draw a well labeled Bunsen burner and state the functions of the parts. This is very simple. This is very simple. Pay attention. Pay attention. So, first of all, you draw the diagram and then we are told to label the parts and state their functions. Let's go. Let's go. This is the barrel. This is the barrel. 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 It is also called chimney. 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 It is also chimney. It is, the, it is made of metal. At the top, we have the, the flame. Now, this is the collar. This is the collar. This is the collar. And we have the air hole. This is the air hole. Air hole. Next is the gas inlet. This is the gas inlet. Gas inlet. And the rubber tubing. The rubber tubing, which is connected to the source of the gas. The rubber, let me just write rubber tube or tubing. Then we have that strong base. It's made of metal or heavy material. This is the base. Let me just write the base. Which other part have I left? Barrel, collar, air hole, gas inlet. We have the rubber tubing and the base. Now, let us start the function of the base. Let's start the base. Base. This is the base. Uh, it is for keeping the Bunsen burner stable. So it's just for, for stability. We write for stability. For stability. It keeps the Bunsen burner it keeps the Bunsen burner stable. Yeah. Then the other one is uh, going to the top, we have the, the rubber tubing. The rubber tubing, this connects the Bunsen burner to a uh, gas source. So rubber tubing, rubber tubing, its purpose or work, the function is to connect, connect the Bunsen burner to the gas, connect the Bunsen burner to the gas source, connect the burner to gas source, gas source. Then next, we can have the gas inlet, gas inlet. This is gas inlet, it is this one here. Its work is to, its work is to connect the, the burner to the rubber tubing yeah, to allow the gas in, to enter into the Bunsen burner. Allows the gas to enter the burner. The burner. Then we have air hole. Air hole. Air hole. Let me just write here. Yes, what do you think is the work or the function of air hole? Bear in mind that you have two types of flames. We have the luminous flame and the non-luminous flame. Yes, so the work of air hole is, the work of air hole is to allow gases to mix, to allow entrance of oxygen. 
So allows oxygen to enter. Air yeah. to enter. To enter the banner. To enter into the into the banner so that it can mix the gas. Then we have the collar. The collar. Collar is very simple. It is just like the adjustment no or the adjusting no. This work is to close the air hole or to regulate the amount of air entering the banner. So it regulates, you can say regulates or adjusts the amount of air entering the banner. Adjusts the amount of air. Entering the banner. Then, lastly, is the chimney. This is where the gases mix, and finally, the flame is produced. Very simple, very simple. <laughs>